So we wanted to actually put this to the test and we actually commissioned cogent research to actually go out and interview litigators across the country, both plaintiffs and defense firms, to understand how important is this idea of early case assessment. And uh, not surprisingly, what we found out was about 75% of the litigators that we had spoken to said that when adopting an aggressive early case assessment model where we really know enough of the facts and the law early on in the case, it has helped reduce litigation expenses. And also not surprisingly is that those firms that have adopted an early case assessment model, about 75% of them as well said that it led to a much more positive impact on case outcome. And what we found out in this study really matches a lot of the trends. If you read the most recent Fulbright and Jaworski trends, uh, BTI Consulting, it all matches up really with the central idea, which is that we need to have a, a model of being able to have some form of an integrated workflow that's centered around early case assessment. So the question becomes really is what exactly is all of your strategic vision moving forward? And not just for the Chinese drywall case. So what I want to be able to do now is to be able to share some best practices of some both law firms and corporations that I've personally worked with where I've seen them take a much more aggressive approach about early case assessment and about adopting an integrated workflow of both content and tools.